So with one of my closest friends selling their alpha boost, I'm going to be doing the same. If the price is right and I find an offer that's good, I'm going to take it and get rid of the alpha boost. But yeah, check out some of these trades. And real quick, if you want to build your dream car or sell any Rocket League item before trading is gone in December, make sure to go to AO1.com. Link in the description. Use the code Zedic at checkout. It's going to get you a cheeky little discount. And we've also got gift cards now if you want to check them out as well. So these are going to be the first 12 trades that I did, obviously, after the news that trading is going to no longer be in the game after December the 5th. So we're going to be going from the smallest amount first and building our way up to obviously one of the alpha items being sold from my inventory so first of all yeah cheeky little trade right there getting rid of a couple boosts now we've got some wildcat ears pretty sure we're getting ourselves a decent amount you know a few hundred credits for wildcat ears i'll take it every day of the week can you see me rocking wildcat ears in 2024 not a chance whatsoever so yeah i'm going to be selling every single item pretty much in my inventory to be honest i've seen comments saying oh you should probably hold it wait I've not got the patience. I've got like 7,000 items to sort out. So many duplicates that I need to get rid of. So yeah, honestly, I couldn't really care less about getting stuff like this. Gone. Um, the Julian Dragons was a bit of a mistake though, because I will have to get that back at some point. The Zeta Wheels, extremely OG. 2016, and obviously a cheeky little, what is that? Uh, FSL, not going to be using that. Getting ourselves 800 credits. Not so bad whatsoever. Then next up, I do believe we're going to be, yes, yeah, shifting off. It's not the full entire set, but pretty much all of the shield breakers. Is that what it's called? I can't even remember. The gold explosions from a rocket pass. I'm not going to be using them. 1,000 credits. Definitely not bad whatsoever, obviously, for some random rocket pass stuff. But yeah, rocket pass items. They could be good in the future, like when it comes up to December, because there may be a few items that people actually want to get before, obviously, they can't get it anymore. So yeah, we're going to be shifting off. The double certs are coming in now. It's going to be the black stones getting 1.7. It's, it's really sad to do, but once again... A white 20XX, I can't see myself using it. I'll have the regular one, but getting myself 2,000 credits. Prioritizing the credits first has to be done. So I've got the credits ready to do whatever I need to at the start of, um, the start of October, start of December. If I need to buy some items, etc., I'm always going to be set and ready for it. This time it's going to be the Grimalkin's gone, also a black Stego for 2k. I think that's the maximum value for the black, uh, what is it, wheels alone. And then we're just adding a Stego on top. So yeah, once again, Haunted Hallow series, which is extremely OG. I just don't care about it, though. I don't really care. It's a shame because I've been so conservative and really, like, I don't know, careful with my items. And now I'm carelessly getting rid of Striker Titanium White um, Inters. You know, it just it doesn't need to be in the inventory anymore. We've got White Octane 5k. So glad I did this. This was, I think, the first or second trade that I did after hearing the news. And, yeah, I'm pretty sure White Octane on the spreadsheet alone is not even 5k now. So we definitely take that. Then, yeah, CC4. Zomba set. I've already got white zombies locked on my account from buying it from the shop, and I'm not, I'm not going to use any of the other colors. I'll be realistic. You know, you do have to be realistic and honest to yourself. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to be rocking burnt sienna, zombies around, and then the almighty 30,000 credits for the beta nugget. I'm pretty sure on the spreadsheet right now, they're 30k at mid. So getting ourselves minimum value for an item that, obviously, it's an alpha item, but. It just has to go. It's a sad truth. And that leaves me with one alpha item to go. Now, I've got a sort of a situation. I need to get the boost gone within the next week or wait until the start of December when there's people panic buying alpha boost. Obviously, that'll be their last chance to get it. So, we'll have to wait and see, fellas. But it's definitely been listed up right now if the right offer comes along. Of course, make sure I subscribe for more daily Rocket League content. And yeah, I guess I'll see you tomorrow.